Hi, and welcome back to a very stormy subsistence. So as promised, I have spent a couple of days gathering resources. I went and got a bunch of pearls and some more sinew, just for the trouble. I've made a couple of ingots and I've repaired all of my weapons and we're in good shape with all of our gear as well. So today I want to do the upgrade that we were looking at. And I'm thinking we'll upgrade the pistol. Because if I look in the box here, we already have semi-upgraded shotgun. We could go to level 2 firepower. That's an option. I'm still undecided, honestly. Let's just see what that would cost. That would cost 12 pills. We can do this. We can afford this. And that would keep it in line with all the other stuff we've got. But because we've got the double barrel now, I'm kind of thinking we should really bring the pistol up. And this other shotgun, really, we, we use it just for killing wolves. And honestly, you really don't need a, an upgraded shotgun for that. So, yeah, let's, let's do the pistol. So, we are going to need six weapon parts and our rope which we've got made over here. Let me put a light on. I didn't realise quite how dark it was. So I, I, I got a bunch of sinew, a bunch of pearls. I think I got 30 something in the end. I've used all of my oxygen tanks. So before we plan our cave trip, we're going to need to make a bunch of oxygen tanks as well. Uh, but yeah, 28 is pretty good. We should have uh, quite a few left over for another upgrade shortly. Let's get this one done. It is very dark in this corner, isn't it? Okay, firepower. Yeah, let's do firepower. And I'm not sure if I want to do reload speed or... I mean, this is pretty cheap. Reload speed or clip size or both. We only need a couple of ingots. Let's grab the iron and copper. Right, so, pistol. Let's get that light back on there because we need it. So level two, and I've done all of these to one clip size extra and one reload speed extra. So we should probably work towards that. So I think I'm just going to need two ingots, one each. And look how short we are of iron already. Now I did make a lockpick, so we'll head out today and go and do some looting. Once the rain subsides, I think. And let's have a look what this costs now to do. Clip size, we need a bit of mass. Uh, we'll need a bit more rope. We'll need sinew for this one. This might be a bit cheaper to do. Four, four, and two. One, two, three, four. Was it, was it scrap? Oh. Well, I've gathered too much there. Let's pop that back down there. No, it was electronics. Okay, so let's put that back. One, two, three, four. And weapon parts. One, two, three, four. Uh, so we just need uh, one ingot and 30 mass, which I think we can drum up pretty quickly. I mean, we could just recycle a bunch of this. Uh, you can't drop it in one by one. Okay. Let's put 15 in. We only need 30 for this. I'm going to need some power. Ah, right. That's the reason why one of our generators is out of fuel. Let's put that on. Let's uh, refill this one too. Okay, 25 in there. That's pretty good. I've also um, harvested the garden completely. Replanted everything. I'll show you the fridge as well. Did a bit of cooking off camera. Much easier to do that kind of thing. On my own, it takes so long to do. Right, reload speed. I think that would be useful. So let's do that. And then we'll need two rope. 
Have we got enough? I don't think we do. We do. We do. We just have enough sinew to get some rope on the go. That's awesome. Um, yeah. Alright, we'll grab 35 we're going to need for that. So, yeah, we can do another batch of scrap. So, another 15 in there. Look at our power. It's going down. Okay, clip size. Right, so five power upgrades, uh, reload speed, upgrade for clip size. Ugh, 500 power. We're down to 618, but it is a stormy day. Let's put that away. We're not going to use any more of this. And we'll keep our water there. These are running full pelt. Uh, we've got a level 10 rabbit. Okay. Okay, this is looking better, isn't it? This might actually be a useful weapon that we've done this. This is actually really useful for the caves because you can easily get headshots with this um, pistol. From quite a distance, actually. It's a surprising uh, weapon. Once upgraded, it might, might turn out to be a bit more useful than I uh, expect. And we've got a hundred um, rounds and we can easily make a bunch more. You know, we've got a bunch here of uh, casings and gunpowder. But yeah, we can take a hundred rounds with us. That would be okay. Cool. Okay, so I need to reload that. And how many shots? Sh we should have we should have eight, I think. Nine. Oh, that is good. I did not know that that loaded to nine. Oh, actually, would it have loaded more if I had more ammo? I don't think so. No, no, nine's the max. That's actually useful, isn't it? Okay, that's going to be good for the caves. I wonder what that is, actually. Let's just have a quick look. I'm thinking, what would that be to upgrade to the next firepower? 20 crystal. Ooh, expensive. Nine rope. That's a lot of sinew to produce that. And then six ingots. So, yeah, we're not going to be doing that anytime soon. And the clip size and the reload speed aren't really worth the investment at this point so good so the only one we need to really think about upgrading is the rifle and then we'll be set uh, we've got 12 pearls for that and four ingots to get that to the second level i don't think we've got enough stuff no so that one will wait that's fine okay We've got our nice lever action uh, now, and of course the uh, the revolver. What I might do if I go down to the caves is I might get rid of the recurve bow for that trip and take the pistol with a hundred rounds um, and just have a full row of, uh, of weapons, upgraded weapons. The only danger in doing that is if I did die down there and I couldn't get my gear back, I'd be a bit stuck. So we've got a spare diving gear. What we don't have is oxygen tanks. How many, how much mass do we have? We can set a couple of these going and start working on those. But what I was thinking of doing is now it's light, we'll grab some food, check on the rabbit and such. Uh, and then we'll kind of go out and see if we can get a lot crates. Yeah, we can only do one at a time. Okay, can I leave these things in here? And then when we get back, we'll just pump out a few of those. Okay, let's grab the rabbits. Uh, and that piece of ore, actually. Hey, okay, well, at least the weather's cleared up. We need our power to build back up again, really. I might turn these mining drills off for a little bit, let everything just top off. I got a chicken as well while I was out. Right, we'll grab the rabbits. 
Oh, look how he's lying down. Um, yeah, you can have that. I'll, ne I'll need to bring some food down. So, kill. Thank you, rabbit. And let's pop that away up here. All right, so this is the fridge right now. Doing pretty well. I'm going to have an apple. And food wise really we've got mm, yeah, steak and eggs will do put those downstairs put that in the fire that's just rotten food from that bug that you know the game does now and then need to drop some fuel bricks in here so i don't lose the fire oh i need to bring food down let me do that while i remember uh, rotten food, all the fire. Let's drop these in here. You know what? I'll leave these as they are for now. I think that was the last of my zinc as well, by the way. Yeah, we've got none in there. And that's all good. Okay, so food for the chicken. We'll only need one tomato or so. I'll take two down just in case. We're pretty good. I'll need to swap out some water. Oh, fire. Top the fires up. Let's just use a bit of wood. Let's feed the chicken. You'll be good for the day. All right, let's do that. Actually, I need water. Let's top up the water and put that on the fire. We'll get that purified. When we get back, I'll grab some out of the chest. And we'll uh, head out and try and do a good loot day. This might be the last one before we head down to the caves. So let's make it a good one. Take some water drop off the wood we might need to grab a bit of wood while we're out and um i've got my lock pick i've got everything else i need yep right let's go i don't know where the chicken's gone i can't see it right now so i'm not going to go and get any cougars we're not going to try and get any pearls had enough of that over the last day or so let's go and see if we can find a locked crate maybe I'm just gonna run down here we've got a wolf let's have a look around the uh, pond here oh yep i see a lock crate across the water that's pretty good then i'm gonna jump in yeah said i wasn't gonna look for pearls but you know, we're swimming here now. Let's grab this lock crate and that chicken and we can run it back to base. Ooh, nice. Yeah, some refined iron's pretty helpful. Right, do you reckon we can grab this chicken? They're getting into any trouble. I've got a feeling he's going to run me into danger. Come on, chicken. You're running me towards the hunters, aren't you? Oh, you little bugger. Where did he go? That way. Okay. He thought I'd lost you. Well, I did for a second, but... I don't think I want to go much further over that way well that was good I kind of stopped and turned around and so did this chicken so we can get this one in the hutch little bugger just stopped on a dime oh my god these things are so speedy sometimes oh there's another one there there's wolf Come on. 
I've been right behind this thing for ages and I just cannot pick it up. Let's do a couple of jumps, confuse it. Yeah, that definitely helps, the jumping. Okay, good stuff. There's another bloody chicken. Oh, there's a bear. So we've done well. We have our luck crates. We've got a chicken. There's an eagle floating in the air there. Got the uh, branch hasn't rendered in. There it has. We could grab another chicken. The only thing is, I, if I'm heading down to the caves, I don't want to have too many of them in the animal housing that they're going to run out of food before I can get back. So... Well, if they die, they die, so we'll make sure they're fed before we leave and we'll kind of see how that goes, actually. Okay, back again. Bought a little friend for you. Alright, let's get inside. We'll drop all of this lovely stuff off. Some planks. Oh, weapon parts are nice. A bit more medicinal. Another fibre. A seed. Oh, yeah, weapon parts. They're good because we've used a bunch of those recently. Okay, good stuff. How are these doing? We've got any biofuel in here. Yep, let's grab a little bit more, top that up. And try and have maximum power before we uh, end, the, end the day. Oh my god. It's going so slowly. What is the, what is the base using? The plant beds. I guess I could turn the lights off on the plant beds. It's such a small amount. It really shouldn't make much of a difference, but I've just I've just run the power down to nothing. Uh, turn that off. Do this quickly while it's raining. There's a good chance by the time we get out it will have nearly finished so okay good stuff so food wise we should probably grab something quickly it's easier than using all of my protein bars up i think i've got a couple of protein bars from that crate as well okay good we are set let's go out and uh well, just see what we can find. Um, yeah, let's go this way. So I might hit up a couple of the big trees. Oh, we're going to have to do some diving. Uh, diving, some fishing soon. Uh, there is a couple of achievements for catching a certain number of different types of fish that I would like to get sorted so we'll probably probably do that i think make sure we're not being followed so i hope you're doing well it's uh, very warm here today it's 27 degrees which for the uk is pretty warm it's supposed to be quite warm for the rest of the week as well so we're having a bit of a late summer i was hoping we would but then again, when you're stuck in a in an office with the heat from the computer on a hot day, it's not pleasant, so I'm going to try and make the most of it and get outside into the garden. Oh, I have a favour to ask, uh, by the way, as well, if you are watching this. The, the viewing numbers on this series have really started to drop recently. Um, are you still watching? Are you still enjoying this series? Would you rather I start a new series? We don't have an awful lot left to do now. I'm just getting rid of achievements at the moment, so... Until the next update, there's not an awful lot I need to uh, complete. So just get your opinions in the comments on, you know, what you'd like to see. Carry on as we are. Raid the hunters a bit more. Maybe build an, an outpost somewhere. 
or wipe this one and uh, start again or maybe keep this one and then if there's an update oh the hunters are involved in a battle somewhere maybe if there's an update we can revisit it but put it on hold for the moment so just get just wanted your opinions on that um, and if you can leave a like on the video it all helps to uh, try and get it seen i don't often say that i'd like to just put a little notification up on the screen you know hit like if you enjoy the video um but uh maybe it's the time of year it's school starting again summer's ended people are finishing off their holidays could just be the time of year But I also have Starfield that I um, purchased and have been enjoying. And I have been thinking about doing a, uh, a little recorded series of that. Like I did a fairly lengthy series of Fallout 4, which I had played several times before. I think I played through it on Xbox twice and then recorded it on PC. And I was still fairly new to PC at that point. And I've been playing a lot longer since I uh, recorded that. But you know, that's something maybe we park this series, leave it alone for a little bit, take a break, and I do some Starfield. Problem is, Starfield is everywhere on YouTube now, everyone's doing it. And if there's not much of a viewership, I'd rather just enjoy it myself, if that makes sense. So. You know, if there's a lot of interest, that's something I could look at doing. Just trying to get some ideas on where to uh, where to go from here, really. Mix things up a bit. We've had the same content on the channel for a long time. This will definitely not go away completely. Uh, maybe we just wait a bit for the next update. So anyway, let me have your thoughts in the comments. That'll be lovely, thank you. So I've kind of been running here, not really looking around too much. We don't have a lockpick, so I'm not bothered too much about keeping my eyes open for lock crates. Um, I am scanning around just in case there are any rogues. Wouldn't be surprised if we ran into some. There's a bit of ore on the rock here, but I think it's potassium. There's some iron on the top. Maybe we can jump up there and grab that. And I saw a couple of fibres that way. Just going to go up here quietly because I do not know what's the other side. Oh, we got zinc. And we have iron. And we've got 24 wood like to get a bit more if we can so we'll kind of hit up the big trees maybe that one over there if there's no uh, animals nearby God, it'd be lovely if this rain would stop now there is a crate down here somewhere where did I see that is it up here Definitely saw that from above. Maybe it's just a bit... Oh, it was on this rock, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's have a look on here. There we are. Let's grab that while we can. Okay, good stuff. Right, let's go and have a look up here. See if there is... I think there was a wolf. I saw a wolf, I think. Yeah, I played through the beginning of Starfield as soon as I got access to it, pretty much. Oh, it was so good. I really enjoyed it. I haven't picked it back up again over the uh, the weekend, unfortunately. I've had quite a bit on. 
but hopefully uh, I can jump into it again this week. Oh, nice. Thank goodness the rain stopped. We're in March still, by the way. This month seems to be really dragging. Right, there's a bear. I saw something. There's a carrot there. Oh, we've got a bit of ore here. Well, this is useful. We're letting our power build back up. We're grabbing some ore that we've used. Did I get zinc? I did get zinc earlier. Mm, I think... Is that... That's potassium. Yeah, okay. What time is it? We're losing the light yet. No, it's about midday, I think. It's just very moody and gloomy. Did we already do this tree? I don't think so. Let's grab this. Yes, we did. Damn it. Right, let's go and find some more trees. I'm grabbing the uh, big six log trees for the uh, grubs so we can make some more fishing tackle. So I'm slowly working my way through the achievements. We're going to have to place a BCU somewhere. And eventually, if we wanted to get full achievements, we would have to build another ATV. But I think I'm going to save that for a new series at some point in the future. Not in any rush, but, you know, it would be nice to tick them all off eventually. Especially for a game we have so many hours um, hours of play in. I feel like I owe it to the game. I'm really hoping we're going to have um, a really meaty update from Cold Games next time. With a reason to travel around the map, hopefully. Maybe some POIs would be nice. We can go out uh, and search for loot and... Oh, hi. Oh dear. Okay. So, okay, let's go this way. Across the water is a pretty good place for all. And it's just a short swim. Something to chase in that deer. We could take that deer down, but it's ammo. The, you know, we don't need it really. Let's have a look under the water to see if there's any pearls. Nope, nothing really. I spent most of a game day swimming up and down with the uh, oxygen tanks used eight oxygen tanks to get those sort of 30 pearls I think it was which is not bad it was all in one day but my goodness I've never seen so much sandstone yeah and sandstone's everywhere again now so kind of interesting Right, let's jump out the water here and we will have a look for some ore. We'll grab this tree first and any fibres that are nearby. There's a bear up the hill looking down at us. Hi. Little chicken. Might need a bit of food. Right, let's grab that to eat. We'll have some water and vegetables. Okay, when we go to the cave, we've got a lot of protein bars and we do have some chutney. So as long as we get a full stack of ammo, all our weapons sorted, we're, we're going to be good for food. I do not want to run out. We've got blueberry water as well, of course, so... Yeah, we should be able to stay down there a little while because getting um, the crates to respawn and the uh, the crystal to respawn does take a bit of time. You have to stay down there a while. Hmm, 
I'm just thinking now whether we should have upgraded that normal shotgun to take down the bats, but I think point blank shot on a bat, you can take it down with one shot just like you do with the wolves anyway. And I really prefer to snipe the bats if I can see them on the ceiling, on the cave ceiling. But those things are a pain in the butt. We've got some antidotes we can take down there with us if we get caught. And this time, of course, we're going to have cave hunters on. <laughs> we had them switched off before when we were grinding for the ATV. But this time around, all hunters will be on down there. So we'll run into cave rogues and we will run into cave hunters as well. Let's take a little swim across the lake here. Oh, it's getting warm in this room, so um, how long have we been going? About 30 minutes. I'm probably just going to have a quick look around for ore on the rocks straight ahead. That lovely long row of uh, slabs of rock. We built a lovely base there with an elevator. It's such a nice location right on the water. I wish there were some more places like that around. Sheer cliff faces or something where you could build up and build into the cliff maybe. There are some big chunky rocks on the mountain side but they're all sort of separate from each other. It'd be nice to have a big facade of rock. Maybe the new area once that's redone around the big lake. Maybe that'll come a few more interesting uh, geological features maybe. Because we've got that lovely broken arch um, rock that's over that way. Memorable um, places that you run past that might make interesting bases. That could be cool. Yeah, I need some vegetables. <laughs> right, we've got a wolf here and two crates. We could take the wolf down. We don't actually need to at the moment. He's wandered away. Just hoping I might find some uh, blueberries. Yeah, he's actually wandered away quite a distance. Let's see if we can grab this one too. Although the bear's coming. Looks like they were swapping places. Oh, there's some uh, blueberry here. He did that. Right, the uh, deer heard me. Got a little too close to that one. More rabbits. We'll make a rabbit stew with our rabbit. Premium rabbit, by the way. There's another berry. And let's grab this ammo crate. Uh, that's the deer over there. Don't really need the deer, but... I don't actually know where I am with my achievements. Um, you ha there's several levels of hunting achievements. So take down so many wolves, bears, deer, cougar, moose. I know I need a lot of moose. I've taken down a fair few deer. Probably not enough. And well, wolves, you know, we're always taking those down. So I should think we're pretty good without those for now. Let's grab that. I wonder if this cougar here has come back. I didn't really want to come here specifically to get a cougar, but while we're so close by, wondering if it's worth just taking a quick look. No, we could run into the cougar right up here. Where is my platform? I think it's just here, isn't it? 
let's have a, a little peek over the edge here. Yeah, here's our platform. Right, where's the cougar? Not seeing it anywhere. Listening for it more than looking, I think. Usually kind of sneaking up there. It might be down here today. It is down here today. Ooh, okay. Should we get this? I think we should. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Let's jump up on this. And yep, he's see Okay, he's run off again. Little bite and a run. Let's jump off the platform. He might stop running now. Should be able to take him down with a second shot. Where did you go? Is that you there? You're just awkward. Just out of, sh out of range. We could probably use a uh, bow and arrow. Whoa! Oh no! Off! Oh, yes, he bit me! He bit me! No! He might bite me and kill me here. Oh no! Oh god. Oh! He bit me! Oh, thank god. <laughs> Oh no. Well, that didn't take down as nearly as much as I thought it was going to do. Oh, we're infected. That's fine. We can grab an antidote. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Okay. That didn't go very well, did it? It was fun though. I really should have that sounded like there was another one over here. That would be a bit of a game changer, wouldn't it? There were two. If you over hunted an area, maybe. Mind you, that's counterintuitive, but still. It would be a bit of a punishment. Yeah, that arrow didn't take down quite as much as I thought. Whether I just got a glancing blow or something, maybe? Rather than a direct hit? I, I don't know, but that was fun. We're infected. We're poisoned. Craft an antidote. Yeah, okay, game. I'm lucky he didn't break my leg because that would have been it. I don't have the um, splint on my task, you know, my toolbar. So I would never, never have made it. Oh, look at the lovely sky. It's a little difficult for me to see. It's a bit dark. Uh, but it's also a very sunny window I'm sitting next to in the office. So level two. Let's get in here. Take our antidote. Okay. All sorted. Nothing to worry about. Oh my goodness. Right. Okay. So... Uh, we can make a couple of fuel bricks. Let's not do it in the uh, crate. Let's drop everything off. And rope sinew. We got four sinew from that. Shouldn't be greedy, should I? We were low, though, and I wanted to make sure we've got stuff to repair. Uh, we got a bandage. We didn't use one in the end, so that's not too bad. Gosh, I don't even have room in there. Okay, let's do the oxygen tanks. We've got full power now. One, two, three. Oh, wait, we need zinc. Luckily, we've got some. Four, five. That should be all of our mass gone. Yes, that is all of our mass. Okay, so a little bit of zinc. We can put that on to refine. Got our ammo to put away. Uh, fishing tackle bait stuff. Oh, I think I've already made all that, that into um, fishing tackle. And seeds. And that doesn't go in there. 
need to top up by our fire and the one upstairs. Let me do that before we lose the fire. Right, we need something to eat, so I'm gonna have... I wonder if I'm hungry enough for that. No. Neither of those. Okay, I'll have a chicken stew then. Chicken stew's pretty good. Okay, we've got premium foods there. We can make some more chicken stew, some uh, rabbit casserole. Uh, rabbit casserole. What does that take? Oh, we can make two as well. Doesn't need any water. Um, okay, let's do that. We'll make two of them. Uh, oh, well, that needs to be cooked. Oh. That is odd, isn't it? Well, I guess it makes sense. We better put these back away, otherwise we're going to lose some of our food. Right, I'll try not to burn that. Let's come back to that in a second. And we'll put this away. That's all the um, footage we have. I've got to make some more. Okay, so I've got a bit of biofuel. How far down did these run? Yeah, pretty far. That was perfect though. That's what I want to leave it at while we're away. Uh, we'll give you a bit of water. Fill all canteens with water. Let's drop those in there. Okay, just need a bit of food for you. Let's go and check on our cooked rabbit. Okay, good stuff. Is this still going? Oh, that's much better, isn't it? Look at that. Yeah, that's more than enough to head down to the caves with. Go and see how this is doing. I'll put a light on up here now. It's very dark. Oh, yep. Yeah, just in time. Right. Grab, grab, grab. Make a couple of rabbit casseroles. Nice, good stuff. And something for the rabbit and chicken. No, we don't have a rabbit anymore for the chickens. Whoops. Okay, all sorted. Good stuff. So when we come back, I think we're going to take a bit of time to just gather everything that we need for a potential cave trip and um, yeah, head down to the lava caves, try and take out a few hunters. Um, I'll put my bow away, we'll take the pistol. We've got the double barrel, we've got the lever action and we've got the um, 44. And I think that should be more than enough. We might take um, some extra health and also our antidotes, uh, maybe another splint, some chutney and top up our um, protein bars and we'll be, uh, we'll be good to go. So that's where I'm going to leave this one. As I say, let me have your thoughts in the comments and uh, have a lovely day. Take care and I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.